Okay, and we're back. Lucky you, me, lucky everybody. So, more records. This is uh, out of a box that they marked 80s. So, just go through and see what we got, you know. All right, uh, average white band. Let's go round. And the flip side is help us on the way. I think that's the A side, isn't it? I think that is. I think I, I don't, I kind of know, but I kind of don't. I, I know who this band is. I'm just not that familiar with them. Yeah. Anyway. Portrait Records. Uh, this is the one. This is Cindy Lauper's label. Money Changes Everything. And. Okay. So there's a live version. And a studio version. So. Here you go. Two copies of the same song. There's another record from portrait so that might be another cindy lopper record girls just want to have fun backed with right track wrong train okay time after time i actually owned this record when it came out and i'll kiss you as the b side so i actually own an old copy of that from way back when and Change of Heart and Witness. Again, Cindy Lauper. Another portrait record here. Some more of that. Um, she Bop. I think I've heard that. So I think these are jukebox records. Because uh, sometimes they put like two A sides, and Witness has showed up twice there. Pete Townshend. Let My Love Open the Door. I think we know that one. And I Moved. One More Night, Phil Collins, and Take Me Home. I think my friend Danny would love that. He gets uh, excited anytime you talk about Phil Collins. Sue Studio, and Don't Lose My Number. I think that this is a double A-side version. That may This may have been in a jukebox, just judging by the way the labels kind of worked there. All right, another Phil Collins, Do You Remember? And I Wish It Would Rain Down. So I think that's also two A-sides, aren't they? Okay, Queen, Another One Bites the Dust. So there's another Queen record that we didn't have, and this is Keep Yourself Alive. All right. Cool. R.E.M., Losing My Religion. And the B-side is Rotary Eleven. That's funny. I know Rotary 10. I've heard that before. I haven't heard Rotary 11. That's interesting. That was like an instrumental piece. Rotary 10 was. Um, let's see. Red Hot and Blue Love, Rick Springfield. And I've done everything for you, Rick Springfield. Let's say, what, these black labels, man. You put them in a jukebox, they show scuffs. Oh, boy, here's an interesting one. Robbie Dupree, Steal Away. And I'm no stranger. Chicago, if she would have been faithful and forever. Okay. What do we have here? This is another Chicago record. This one's got a wrinkled up sleeve. You're the inspiration. And once in a lifetime. Ray Charles with Willie Nelson, Seven Spanish Angels, and Ray Charles with Willie Nelson, Who Cares? Oh, no, Ray, Ray Charles with Janie Fricky, Who Cares? Hmm, Janie Fricky was a country, she made, she's like country pop, uh, kind of a not, a, not a long career, but I know who that is. Chicago, be hard to say I'm sorry, and... Let me think twice. I suppose Chicago fans would be excited. The REO Speedwagon in my dreams and over the edge. Let's see David Bowie, Modern Love, and Modern Love again. So 
This one says live stereo, and this one is studio stereo. So that's, again, same song recorded twice. So we have that kind of like that Cindy Lauper record where you have the same song on both sides, but they're two different takes. Doobie Brothers, Too High a Price, and The Doctor. Alan Parsons Project, Children of the Moon. And Psycho Babble. I always thought it was ducks that were on the moon, not children. Anyway. Alan Parsons Project, Time, and The Gold Bug. Air Supply, Here I Am. And I've Got Your Love. One of my favorite punk rock bands actually had a sarcastic song called It's Not My Fault You Like Air Supply. And I've never forgotten that. Let's see. More Air Supply, Every Woman in the World. And My Best Friend. Well, more Air Supply, <laughs> Old Habits Die Hard. And All Out of Love. I think we, a lot of these songs I remember from being played to death on the radio. More Air Supply, Don't Turn Me Away, and Sweet Dreams. I know the Eurythmic Sweet Dreams. That's a cool song. Um, Even the Nights Are Better, Air Supply again, and One Step Closer. So, oh, and here's a reprint of the Air Supply from Flashback Records. All out of love there, backed with old dab habits die hard. So there's a reprint. Oh, Dr. Hook and the Medicine Show. Love Line. And Love Line again. So this is a promotional copy. Let's see, stereo on that side. Is it mono on the other side? No, it's just stereo on both sides. So probably a radio record. I'll give you the same song on both sides so you can play it more without it wearing down. David Bowie, China Girl. Yeah, I know that one and shake it. Okay, so there's the first chunk of that stack. There's a lot in this box. So we're going to be here a while. Okay, next pile. Wild Wild Life by Talking Heads. I know that one. And People Like Us movie version. Okay. I didn't know there was a movie version. Lorelei by Tom Tom Club. That one's not registering in my brain. Flip side is Genius of Love. Tom Tom Club. That doesn't register with me. Um... In the Chill of the Night, Kim Carnes. And Cry Like a Baby. So, Kim Carnes. I should, I, I don't know, I may have heard it. It doesn't, that one doesn't ring with me here. More Kim Carnes. Maybe I'll see a song here and be like, I know what that is. Changing. And More Love. What is this? Stars on 45, radio records, medley, intro, Venus, sugar, sugar, no reply, I'll be back, drive my car, do you want to know a secret, we can work it out. This is interesting, this is like a, this is like a whole bunch of songs, all rammed into one. Stars on 45 by Stars on 45. What? I I don't know what this is, but that's okay. It'll be interesting to see what that is. Performed by stars on In Tribute to Stevie Wonder. Okay. There's a lot of song titles here. I don't know what this is. Stars forty stars on forty five get ready three. Performed by stars on. 
What? I don't know what that is. Those will, that'll be interesting. We'll find out maybe what that is. Simply red, I don't feel bad. And holding back the years. Oh, yes. We know that song. Have you ever been at a doctor's office in the 80s? Steve Perry, oh, Sherry. And don't tell me why you're leaving. That one's not registering with me. Before I go by Starship. Okay, so remixed and... Okay, this is the remixed version of Before I Go. Remixed as in, like, what, a dance version? Um, we Built This City. Arguably one, one of the records for the worst song of all time. Uh, private Room Instrumental on the B-side. I didn't hate Starship. Oh, let's see. Los Lobos. Let's say goodnight. Let's see what's on the B-side. Come on, let's go. Okay, so this would be from the La Bamba soundtrack, probably. Movie. The Rovers, wasn't that a party? Backed with Matchstick Man, Matchstick Cats and Dogs. The Rovers. Is that the Irish Rovers? Maybe. Maybe not. Daddy's Bobby song by the Rovers. And Pain in My Past. Okay. Let's see, what do we have here? We have Chillin' Whack, My Girl Gone, Gone, Gone. And Sign Here. That one I don't know. But that's okay. Let's see, take a chance by Rat. Uh, they, uh, see, they actually did the stylized band logo. I always thought that was cool, but sometimes it's hard to read it and dance. Okay. And here they did. They didn't do the stylized logo, but there's another Rat record. Uh, the morning after and round and round. So there's some rock and roll for you. Roger Daltrey, ex Escape Part 1, and Without Your Love. So, Roger Daltrey post The Who, I suppose. Ambrosia, Living on My Own, and Biggest Part of Me. Okay. Carly Simon, Jesse, and Stardust. Okay, Cindy Lauper, maybe he'll know, and I Drove All Night. That one I don't know. I always remembered her being on Portrait Records rather than on Epic, but okay. Here's another Epic, uh, Queen, Another One Bites the Dust. We saw another pressing of this earlier, and Don't Try Suicide. Well, that's good advice, I suppose. All right. Robbie Dupree, Brooklyn Girls, and Lonely Runner. Robbie Dupree, Hot Rod Hearts, and Love is a Mystery. Rick Astley, never going to give you up. Oh my gosh, this is the ultimate like meme joke. I think we should put this in the jukebox just as a meme. And change the jukebox tag to say best joke ever. Or as not best best joke ever, best song ever. Yeah, best song ever. Gotta play the song. And then everybody will officially be Rick Rolled. And uh, 2006 called it once. It's joke back. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay, Queen, I Go Crazy. And Radio Gaga. In fact, I'm going to set that Rick Astley record aside just so I can troll my wife with it because she'll find it funny that I actually got that in there. My record auction hall, Rick rolled me. All right, Quarter Flash, Don't Be Lonely, and Harden My Heart. I don't know if I know that song. Canvas, All I Wanted, and We're Not Alone Anymore. See, walking on sunshine. Let's see, who's, who's the art? I can't. 
man, what is the, that again with the stylized Katrina and the stylized fonts, guys? I can't read them and make sure I spell everything right. I'm going down to Liverpool, okay. I think I know what that is. Let's see. Kenny Loggins. There we go. The more we try. And heart to heart. I know the record labels think they're smart by putting the band logo as the name, but sometimes it's hard to read. Connie O, The Four Seasons. So that's an older record, I think. Unless it's a repop. And soon I'll be home again. More Four Seasons. Tell It to the Rain. And Dawn. Yeah. Uh, we know that one. Don't go away, I'm not good for you. Yeah, it's probably period correct for a jukebox. Alone and Toy Soldier, again, Four Seasons. More Four Seasons records. Ain't that a shame? I thought that was a Fats Domino song. And Mar Marlena. Blah. That's a, I'm trying to read upside down or whatever. Let's see, Frankie Goes to Hollywood, one September Monday, and relax. So Frankie say relax. There's another meme of a record if there ever was one. Frankie and the Knockouts, Don't Stop, and Sweetheart. Okay. Good Thing by Fine Young Cannibals. And social security. I want to know what love is by Foreigner and Sweet Thunder. I think we're going to get a good stack of Foreigner here. Uh, two different worlds, and that was yesterday. Okay, and what's next? Ario Speedwagon. I wish you were there, and. Don't let him go. Ario Speedwagon, follow my heart and keep on loving you. Uh huh. It's a Pasha record. I'm familiar with this. Oh, Quiet Riot, bang your head. Mental health will drive you mad. There you go. That's nice. And the B side is. Also, bang your head. A live version. So this is again a studio and live. Maybe maybe a juke or maybe a, a radio record. Okay. And uh, more quiet riot. Run for cover. And feel the come feel the noise. Okay. Oh, there's some. That's some like you know very 80s rock and roll jukebox music, isn't it? Uh, Christopher Cross, Think of Laura, and Words of Wisdom. That sounds kind of familiar, but it's not registering correctly in my brain, so I'm not sure I know that song, but I think I do. Let's get another stack out here. Keep on going. I suppose it already made my day that I got rickrolled by my stack of records okay leo sayer millionaire and more than i can say gloria by laura bran brannigan okay i think i know which one that is and living a lie i think i know which song that is if i got the artist right I'm associated with the right song title midnight blue lou graham and Chain of Love, Lou Graham. This kind of wear pattern like that, that's that's indication this thing's been in a jukebox for sure. Apparently people picked it because it's been played. Let's see. Little Liar, Baby Tush Mix, Joan Jett and the Blackhearts. And What Can I Do For You, Joan Jett and the Blackhearts. Okay. John Cougar Mellon Camp, Small Town. And there's two versions of Small And there's two versions of Small Town on here. Acoustic and Studio. Another John Cougar. Small Paradise. And Hand to Hold On To.
and another John Cougar. Can you take it? And Jack and Diane. Ugh. I'm sorry, that one's been played to death. I don't want to hear that song anymore. <laughs> Again, I didn't hate it till I played it a hundred times. Make me feel and ain't even done with the night. Again, somebody must have really had a lot of good Melon Camp records there. If you're into him, that's cool. Oh, this is interesting. Jive Bunny and the Master Mixers, Glenn Miller Medley. So is this like a dance record? Jive Bunny and the Master Mixes, Swing the Mood. This sounds, let's see, 1989. This is probably like a dance remix of Big Band. That's interesting, if nothing else. I don't know who, I don't know what that is. Let's see, we have Jay Giles Band Centerfold. Yeah, we know what that is. And what's the B-side? Rage in the Cage. And there's Rage in the Cage by Jay Giles Band and Centerfold. So we have two different prints, I guess, from different uh, runs, I guess, same record, but different printings, pressings. John Cougar Mellencamp, Pink Houses, and Serious Business. Um, close enough, John Cougar Mellencamp, and Kurt's so good. We know that one. And more John Cougar Mellencamp, Under the Boardwalk, and Rock in the USA. Yep, we know that one too. Another John Cougar Mellencamp, Rain on the Scarecrow, and Pretty Ballerina. That one's not registering with me. I don't remember those songs, I don't think. Kaja Goo Goo, Too Shy, and Take Another View. Kenny G doing Songbird. And... Let's see, what does it take to win your love? Okay. Well, Songbird, if you've ever been in a doctor's office, you know what it sounds like. What kind of jukebox would they put that in? I don't know. You Keep Me Hanging On, Kim Wilde, and Loving You. That sounds like it might be a repop of an older 60s song. Cause they're, okay, UB40, Red Red Wine. There we go. We know that one. And Suffering. Did they do anything interesting with that record? No, it's just a plain record. George Thorogood, Howlin' for My Baby, and Baby Don't Go. Glenn Fry, All Those Lies, and The One You Love. That's the A side, I think. Okay. And we have here. Vandenberg, Burning Heart, and Ready For You. UB40 with Chrissy Hind. I Got You, Babe. Like the Sonny and Cher song. And Nicomo, Nicomo A Go Go, specially remixed version. Okay, if you say so. Withdrawn from somebody's library. Okay, this was once a library record. Van Halen, Inside, and Dreams. Garfield Station Library. So that was once a library record, and they probably sold it off eventually. Chariots of Fire. I remember that was like very, very popular instrumental. And Eric's theme. Okay. And we have here Chippin' Away, Night Ranger, and Sister Christian. I think that's the A side, right? Yeah. Okay, more records, more, more, more. I'm going to have to start a separate stack, though. I'm going to put Jive Bunny over here just because that one, that's got my curiosity. Oof, what in the world? Remix. Dance remixes of big band. They're gonna hear what that sounds like. I'm sure somebody's like screaming. 
at the thing going, you didn't know what that was, I played that on the radio four million times. I was never a big radio listener. Oh well. Okay. Marshall Tucker Band, Without You, and so one mono, one stereo, so that's a radio record for sure. They were still doing mono and stereo flips? What year was this? Do they have to publish in here? Sometimes they do. I don't see it on this one. 1980, so I guess there were still enough AM stations of broadcasting music. Okay, this is Electro. This is from the Cocktail soundtrack. So that's Little Richard, Tutti Fruity, and what did they put on the B side? Kokomo, the Beach Boys. Go figure. Of course. Couldn't have put like Starship, Wild Again, or one of the other songs from that movie that was Kokomo again. Wasn't a terrible song, but just run into the ground. It was okay once in a while. Leo Sayer, more than I can say, and Living a Fantasy. Okay, we're going to have to start another stack because this one's going to, the one over there is going to get too teeter tottery. Opus, live, live, live is life. And she loved you. Oh, I know that one. Larry Graham. I never forgot your eyes and moving inside your love. That sounds like a bad metaphor. Uh, let's see. Lover boy, turn me loose and prissy prissy. More lover boy here for you. Uh, bullet in the chamber backed with loving every minute of it. Yes. Okay. And even more. This could be the night, and it's your life. Oh, okay, this is actually uh, more Los Lobos. This is more of the Richie Valens stuff. So, who my head, and come let's go. So we've got two cuts of that particular A side with different B sides. Neil Diamond, Heart Light, and you don't know me. Let's see more Neil Diamond. Yesterday's songs and guitar heaven. And what do we have here? We have Foreigner, I'm Gonna Win, and Waiting for a Girl Like You, and more Foreigner, Girl on the Moon. I told you ducks are on the moon. And Urgent, more Foreigner, Nightlife. And Jukebox Hero. There's another song that's been run into the ground. And even more Foreigner for you. Say You Will. Backed with A Night to Remember. Fame, Lucky Enough for Two. And Rock and Roll World. Let's see, what do we got? Long Ago by Hulo and Mulligan. And what's on the B side? Every, oh, that's nice. You can't say that title. I don't know if I know that record. I wonder if, is this supposed to be comedy? <sighs> uh, again, one of those records that's so obnoxious, I have to see what it is. A promo record not for sale, so probably a radio record of Devo doing Secret Agent Man. Yeah, stereo mono. That's interesting. Lover Boy again. Turn Me Loose. And Turn Me Loose again. So this would, oh, short version and album version. So this is a radio record. It had the, the full version and then it had the shortened version for the two minute whatever. The Whites, I Wonder Who's Holding My Baby Tonight, and Follow the Leader. E.G. Daily, Love in the Shadows, and Little Toy. Let's see the, the Deals, Two Occasions, and 
is the same song on both sides, probably. Instrumental version. Yep. So it's a deals two occasions. Okay. David and David swimming in the ocean and ain't so easy. I don't know that song, I don't think. Let's see. All sports band run away and young girl. Some of these are confusing me. So this this radio records label and some of the stuff that I've seen on it was weird so far. Let's see. Satisfy your lust by who is this? It says Robin Scott, but that's the songwriter. Who's the artist? M produced by Robin Scott. Okay, M. Okay. That's the way the money goes. I I don't know what that is, but okay. Oh, interesting. Jerry Lee Lewis from later in his career, 39 and holding. And change places with me. That might have been when he was doing more of the bluesy kind of stuff. That's interesting. We'll check that out. Gordon Lightfoot, Dream Street Rose, and okay, that's again another, so let's see, we have one side that's stereo, is the other side mono? Yep, stereo and mono. Okay. Greg Kin Band, Happy Man, and Trouble in Paradise. Hmm. Okay. Campaign, let your body rock. This is a demonstration. This is probably another radio disc. Yep. Both sides are stereo, but same song, both sides. Let's see. The Comatines. Get off my case. And Ice Machine. Let's see, this can't go on, the lover speaks, and no more I love yous. Okay. Okay, this is, let's see, Lindsay Buckingham, Go Insane, and Play in the Rain. Leo Sayer, Only Foolin'. And living in a fantasy. Did I already see that one earlier? I know we've seen some other his records earlier. Now as we're getting down into some of these, some of these have like, they're in extra sleeves, like they were trying to protect them. So there might be some really good ones coming up. Let's see, Freakazoid, Midnight Star. And no parking on the dance floor. Okay. Gold records or something. Um, George Michael, Too Funky, and Crazy Man Dance. Okay. This one's in a beautiful protective sleeve. This is like in really new condition. Robert Palmer, Disturbing Behavior, is the B. And early in the morning, single version is the A. Lover Boy by Billy Ocean, dub mix. And the original mix is on the A side. Well, this is interesting. My, this is something we probably may have heard. The Oak Ridge Boys, Elvira. Yeah, that was all over country and pop music. 1981. Woman like you is the B side. All right. Gary Gary Newman, metal, and cars. Okay. Portrait record. Okay, so somebody wrote some numbers. This reached number 23 in 1982, I guess. Okay, good. Fantasy by Aldo Nova and Under the Gun. Okay. Night Ranger, Chipping Away, and 
sister Christian. That allegedly, see, somebody put some numbers on here, like that maybe made made it up to number 67 on a chart. So, oh, here you go. This would this would make my wife happy. New kids on the block, hanging tough. We got to give her a copy of that. She would just get a laugh out of that. What's the B side? Didn't I blow your mind? So we're going to just set that aside as a joke. And I'll take that up there with Rick Astley and tell her that I found her favorite records. There you go. 99 Luft Balloons. And what's on the B side? Is that the German version? Do they have the German and the U and the English version? Let's see. This is, is this the A side or the B side? English translation by Silas. Da, 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 da. So that, I think that's the English version. Is this the German version? That's 99 Luft Balloons. Yeah. So red balloons, duh, English, German. Very cool. I actually like the later thing that Goldfinger, the sort of ska punk band, did their own version of the song. And I, they did the English version up till the third verse. And hearing high energy, punk rock energy sung in German just sounds scary. It's the angriest thing you've ever heard. Willie Nelson, the party's over. And always on my mind, that is a well-known record. And I know that one. Nelson. That's Rick Nelson's kids, right? Two twins or whatever. Will you love me and can't live without your love and affection? The time is now, naked eyes. And always something there to remind me. Oh, yes. Always something to play to death on the radio. Alana Miles, Love Is, and Black Velvet. Oh, yeah. We're recognizing a lot of these songs now. Let's see. Murano by Murray Head, and One Night in Bangkok. Mm. Mr. Mr. Run to Her. And Kyrie. Mr. Big to be with you and green tinted 60s mind. Mr. Big Road to Ruin. Just take my heart. This is definitely an 80s pile, but you know what? It's not that... There's actually a lot of records in here that are, you know... They, they, I think I think they'll they'll find a market if, if I'm not keeping them. Robert Plant, Horizontal Departure, and In the Mood. So that's when Robert Plant did his stuff. Post is up one. Alan Parsons Project, Gemini, and Eye in the Sky... More Alan Parsons. Don't answer me. And don't let it show. Ah, there's something everybody's heard a hundred thousand times. Ray Parker Jr. Ghostbusters theme. I swear these were this was in every jukebox back then. That was like a big thing. And uh, this and let's see is probably what was probably an instrumental version or whatever, or maybe it's just a A side, B side. I don't know. It doesn't really matter. But uh, humorously enough, that Ray Parker Jr. song was, he was told to try to sound as much like Huey Lewis as you could because Huey Lewis was supposed to do the song and then backed out. And so that song was like, it's so Huey Lewis, it's scary. Um, let's see. What is this? Waylon, I came here to party. And Clyde. Okay. Let's see. White Water Instrumental. And Shine. So more Waylon. Wish some of these didn't get wrinkled. I haven't necessarily found like the one record that just sets my brain on fire, but that's okay. I'm not disappointed. Okay, the artist 
who was known as Prince and then formerly known as Prince and then as Prince again, Little Red Corvette. And all the critics love you, New York. Let's see, all the critics love you in New York, okay. That must have been a B-side, I don't know that song. And I think we got more, let's see. Prince and the NPG get off and Horny Pony. That sounds really polite. Wrapped Around Your Finger by The Police, and Tea in the Sahara. Okay, another police record, Flexible Strategies, Spirits in the Material World. Another police record, A Sermon, and Don't Stand, Don't Stand, Don't Stand So Close to Me. Oh, yes. Again, play it to death, guys. Oh, there you go. Poison. Which one is this? Swamp Juice and Unskinny Bop. So two songs on one record? On one side, huh? Is it? Yeah, it's a double. Okay, and then what's on the B? Uh, Valley of Lost Souls. Okay. Bonnie Raitt, something to talk about. Some of these look to be in really good condition. I Can't Make You Love Me. Another poison record. I like the sleeve with the cow on it there. Every Rose Has Its Thorn. And Living for the Minute. Tom Petty, Down the Line. That's the B. And the A would be Free, Free, Fall In. Free, Free, Fall In. She's a good girl, and she's crazy about nonsense lyrics. All right. Uh, Making Some Noise is the B. Another Tom Petty record, and Into the Great Wide Open. Okay. Another Tom Petty, Too Good to Be True, and Learning to Fly. Another Tom Petty record, Love is Long Road is the B, and the A would be You're So Bad. Okay. Oh, these are actually some, like I say, I, every time you get a box of records at like an auction or a garage sale, you think you're going to get all Lawrence Welk or something or Mitch Miller. But no, Ozzy Osbourne, Sin, and the B-side is No More Tears. Oh, yes, we know that. Oh, and here is, that's a CBS pressing, and then this is an Epic pressing. Uh, no More Tears, Ozzy Osbourne, with changes on the B-side. Another Ozzy gets me through on album version, which is five minutes. That's album version on both sides, so it's another double-sided record. Five minutes. You can't play it on the radio. It's five minutes long. Split, Spin the Black Circle by Pearl Jam? Seriously? Seriously. That's... Wow. Wow. I, not, not to say that this is like the greatest record ever, but that's crazy. I would have never expected anything this not old in, you know, I was expecting, again, I was expecting a bunch of really, really old, worn out records and tired sleeves, and then something like that turns up. I'm not a huge Pearl Jam fan, but that song is just psycho, and I kind of like it. Eddie Money, Don't Worry, and Two Tickets to Paradise. Pack your bag, we'll leave tonight. Um, Eddie Money again, Calm Before the Storm, and Take Me Home Tonight. You know that one. I'm probably going to get a copyright strike for just mumbling lyrics to myself. Hmm. <sighs> Lost in the 50s tonight by Ronnie Millsap, country-ish kind of record. And the B-side is I Might Have Said. Ronnie Millsap, my dad was a big Ronnie Millsap fan. I liked his work generally. Men at Work, Anyone for Tennis. And Who Can It Be Now? That's his, who can it be now? I think that's the right song. Men at Work again, crazy, backed with... Down Under. Oh, there's another meme if there ever was one. 
I'll put that in the meme pile to go troll the wife with. And we're back to John Cougar Mellencamp again. Serious business. And pink houses. I think we've already saw that one before. Another John Mellencamp after he stopped being a cougar. Brothers, live version, and Wild Night. And here he was still a cougar, never too old, and paper in fire. And another John Cougar record, Can You Take It, backed with Jack and Diane. That's the second time we've seen that one. Um, let's see, Close Enough, and Hurts So Good. <laughs> Okay. We're getting there. There's a couple records I was like, oh, it would be so cool if I found them, but I didn't yet, but that's okay. See, some of these I'm seeing again for the second time. Doobie Brothers, The Doctor, and Too High a Price. Eddie Rabbit, Short Road to Love. Backed with Rainy Night, Love a Rainy Night. You know what was so stupid is this song, when I was when I was really young, this had hit the radio. And if I wanted one country record for my jukebox, that was the record. And my friends, we just hit the jackpot. We hit the friggin' jackpot. It was so dumb. I said to myself, wouldn't it be cool if I found that record in there? Anyway, Baby Love, Regina, on both sides. Promo record or stereo mono or I don't know. Anyway, REM. Okay, Bang and Blame. We know that song. And that's on both sides? Okay, so same song, both sides. Winged Mammal Theme by REM. I don't know that one. And Drive. Oh, I know that one. Uh, drive, I. I, I I like, I'm trying to, it wasn't light drive, it's uh, driver eight is the one I liked a little bit more. Um, Rotary 11 again, and that was the one that was on the flip side of losing my religion. So we have more than one copy of that. Um, let's see, New Orleans instrumental number two. I believe I know that one. What's on Man on the Moon? There you go. Man on the Moon, REM. Yeah, 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 yeah. More REM. What's the frequency, Kenneth? And. That's on both sides. What's the frequency, Kenneth, is your benzedrine oh ho. And if I said the lyric wrong, that's just because y'all pronounced it wrong in the song. One Vision by Queen on both sides. Probably another radio record. Quarter Flash, Find Another Fool. And Harden My Heart. Don't know that one. Oh, more Prince. House Quake, and You Got the Look. Stand by Poison, and Until You Suffer Some by Poison. Okay. The Pretenders, Angel of the Morning. Is that the what I think it is? Just come in, get on the morning, angel. Is that what that is? I thought that was an older song. Uh, Night in my veins. Maybe I'm maybe I'm right, maybe I'm wrong. I don't know. Uh, John Cougar Mellencamp, Golden Gates, and Crumbling Town. That's one of those I haven't seen yet. John Mellencamp, Rock in the USA. We've seen that one before. And Dance Naked. There you go. That's some good advice for everybody. Go dance naked. Let's see. Queen, another one bites the dust. And that's backed with Don't Try Suicide. So we have seen that one before. And again, good advice is to anybody. Don't try suicide. Did I, I swear I put some of these, either they're like over here in this stack, or maybe there are doubles in here. But uh, Quiet Riot, Come On, Feel the Noise, and Run for Cover. So that completes that box. There still is one more box to sort through. Let me try to get the stack at least out of the way. 
So we have some more room. I'm actually, like I say, I'm thoroughly impressed with what we've pulled out of this uh, stack here. And it's not that all of these are necessarily my favorite songs, but these are like realistic kind of, you know, jukebox records. This is, you know, stuff that you would, this is like, you know, not, it's not Lawrence Welk. And again, no insult to anybody who likes Lawrence Welk. If you like Lawrence Welk, that's great. If you like, uh, you know, I, I mean, I don't know. If you like John Denver or something, that's fine too. I have no problem with John Denver, but that's not the kind of stuff, you know, you would hear necessarily in a jukebox. And I was thinking about jukebox records and it's like there were a number of things that came to mind. And some of this stuff really fits the bill. It's, it's interesting. It's a diverse collection of stuff. And there's a good number of records. So if you like your vintage stuff, you got it. And if you like your 80s stuff, you got it. And again, to see see some of the artists like, you know, like REM and stuff like that in this stack, it's kind of a surprise to me. Okay, so we're on to the last box. We have Mood, R Roberta Flack, and Donnie Hathaway. And the flip side is Where is the Love? Detroit by Paul Humphrey and his Kool-Aid chemists. Huh. Okay. Did I already do this? Did I do this box? I think I did this box. I did this box. I grabbed another box that I already did. Hold on. I'm an airhead. I already looked through this box. I mixed up the boxes. There are four boxes. We have done three boxes. As soon as I saw Kool-Aid chemists, I knew this was a box I had already gone through. Let's try. It would be this box. This is the box we still need to go through. Hey, at least I only popped two records out of that stack before I realized I had already gone through all of them. Okay. This one supposedly has some country in it. Lover's Minute by, or Minuet by Floyd Kramer and Dallas. I know Floyd Kramer was famous for that last date, that piano piece that was really kind of mellow. Mac Davis, Home for My Little Lady, and Baby Don't Get Hooked on Me. Uh, Mac Davis, that's an older one because that's a mono record. Billy Joe Spears, Come On Home, and I Stayed Long Enough. Yeah, that was a Tammy Wynette song. We got country here, y'all, and this is grand old Opry country. It's not that new rap stuff you guys are trying to pass off as country. I Feel Like a Little Love by David Sugar and Golden Tears. That one I do not know, but that's okay. Everything a Man Could Ever Need, Glenn Campbell, and Norwood, Me and My Guitar. That's a Mac Davis song that was recorded by Glenn Campbell. Mac Davis, Burning Thing, and Special Place in Heaven, I believe that says. It's hard to read. Yeah, Special Place in Heaven. Okay. There's one Mac Davis song that was my dad's favorite. Not any of these. Kyrian Kane, Surrender to Your Heart, and Dedicate. I don't know that song. Just an old love song by Stan Garland. And moving on. Moving on. It's spelled correctly there. Another Kyrian Kane, Surrender to Your Heart, and Dedicate. So we've already seen that one once. Oh my goodness, you got to be kidding me. Chris Cross, Sound of My Hood. Backed with I'm Real LP version. And this is these jump jump kids, aren't they? From was that was that that was that early nineties? I I can't believe I've ever seen any other song out of them. Okay though. Oh, here's another Dave and Sugar. Quit looking 
gotta quit looking at you, baby, and you are the one. Okay. Another Mac Davis. I'm just in love. And every now and then. Oh, Cajun Moon and Rockin' the Boat, Ricky Skaggs. Ricky Skaggs was one of my dad's favorite artists. He was a country fan. Those two, I think, I think I know Cajun Moon. I think that one doesn't quite get it. Let's see, Memory Lane, Joe Stampley, and Jessica Boucher. And couldn't, let's see, Could It Wait Until Forever by Joe Stampley. That sounds like I, something I've heard, but I can't put it down. And here's another Joe Stampley. I'm Still Loving You and The Weatherman. Okay. More Joe Stampley, Billy Get Me a Woman, and She Has Love. More Joe Stampley, The Most Beautiful Girl. Is that is that the one the country saw? Hey, if you happen to see the most beautiful girl in the world. I think it is, late 70s. And The Nighttime and My Baby. Maybe I'm, I don't know, maybe I got the wrong artist thing, whatever, but just trying to go through. More Joe Stampley, The Fool, and I'm Going Hurtin'. What would you, what would I do then? And every day I have to cry some. Somebody had a lot of Joe Stampley records. Uh, Skeets McDonald. That's a country name if there was. She's never gone that route before. Backed with There Sits an Angel, <laughs> Lover Boy, again, It's Your Life, backed with This Could Be the Night. And you can see the wear pattern on that. This was definitely picked up and put down by a jukebox, for sure. You even see those three dots there. That just screams I've been picked up by a jukebox. There comes that sinking feeling by the Eurythmics. And Would I Lie to You, the Eurythmics. That's, I think, Would I Lie to You, that came out after Sweet Dreams and Touch. That was later in the, that was later down the road. Interesting. Let's see, Marty Gray, Billy Joseph Spears, True Love, okay. Jukebox Junction. So this apparently was the place that sold jukebox records in Michigan. Sawyer Brown, Shaken, and Billy Does Your Bulldog Bite. Okay. Another Sawyer Brown record, The House Won't Rock, and let's see, and what this, let's see, Sawyer Brown with Cat Joe Bonsall, Going Out Catting, okay. I don't know if I know that song. Ann Murray, that's whatever for. And I'm happy to just dance with you. And here's another one of the same one. Ann Murray, I'm happy to just dance with you. And backed with, could I have this dance? So apparently they were really on a dance theme. Eddie Money, Peace in Our Time. And Where's the Party, the live version. More Eddie Money, Baby Hold On, and Two Tickets to Paradise. So this is obviously, it's a Hall of Fame restamp. This would be really a jukebox record because it's got essentially two A-sides. All right. Oh. Hello there, Glass Monster. How are you? I wasn't paying attention to the comments. What's up? I'm here. It's a live stream. I'm, I'm looking over... Here at the uh, panel, the computer screen's off to the side. Oh, anyway, don't want to forget my Steve Miller record we had here. We had Ya Ya and Filthy McNasty. Great song title. Let's see, Mel McDaniel, Now You're Talking, and Sunday Morning Preachers. Mel McDaniel again, I Call It Love, and Goodbye Marie. When Somebody Loves You by Restless Heart, 
and a little more coal on the fire. Okay. Power of Love. LP version by Luther Vandross. And I Don't Want to Be a Fool, LP version by Luther Vandross. Okay. Come from the Heart, Kathy Matea. And True North. Ashes by Martina McBride. And Life Number Nine. Let's see, Mac McNally, Somewhere Nice Forever, I think that says. And Junk Cars. Okay. Maze featuring featuring Frankie Beverly, Silky Soul, and Midnight. Patty Page and Tom T. Hall, We're Not Getting Old. And the B-side is I Don't Know. This was apparently in a poorly maintained jukebox or something. Tom T. Hall, I know, was a bit of a humorist. He tended to do things that were kind of on the funny side of things, like The Monkey That Became President, which was done back in the 70s, so it wasn't about anything current. Um, let's see. Vicky Carr, it must be him, backed with, it must be him again, so that must have been a promotional record. Not a song I'm familiar with. Don Cornell, No Man is an Island. I believe that was a very famous song, backed with Athena. Dionne Warwick, Planes, Boats, and Trains. Call the Psychic Friends Network now. And I'll never fall in love again. <laughs> Willie Nelson and Neil Young together. Are there any more real cowboys? And I'm a memory. Willie Nelson. And we have a second copy of that record. Another Willie Nelson record. So much like my dad and Heart of Gold. Wait, Heart of Gold was a Neil Young song, wasn't it? Oh, okay. Willie Nelson. No let's, let's see. What, does, that, does that credit Neil Young as a songwriter? Yeah, it does. Neil Young. So that's Willie Nelson covering Neil Young. Got it. See, Willie Nelson, I'm not trying to forget you. And I've got the craziest feeling. What? Oh, my sound is very low. Yeah, it's probably because it's a, a directional microphone and I'm kind of talking off to the side of it. I'll crank it up a little bit if it makes you happier. This is high definition video, Bosch. You should be able to see the titles just fine as I'm zooming through. Unless you're viewing them on your phone. Let's see, so I should have bumped the audio. That should be louder for you. Anyway, let's see. More Willie Nelson. We have uh, still is still moving to me and Valentine. A super Willie Nelson fan, so I don't know all of these. What do we have on this side? We have Aaron Neville, House on a Hill, and Everybody Plays the Fool. Yeah, we've heard that one a hundred times. Hey, everybody plays the fool. Yep. Reba McIntyre, Little Girl, and... Am I the only one who cares? More Reba McIntyre. The night the lights went out in Georgia. And all dressed up with nowhere to go. Pop singer John Cougar Mellencamp. And JM's Question. And we have Don McLean. Since I don't have you... And Your Cheating Heart. Is that the Hank Williams song? Yeah, it's a Hank Williams song. It's a cover by Don McLean. Okay. Let's see. We'll grab another stack and just keep going. So we've, we've found some interesting things right now. And our, our record stack Rick rolled us, so that's just, right now, that's just funny.
got Rick rolled by my own uh, record stacks. Okay, the controllers. Nothing can stop this feeling. And uh, is that crushed? Yeah, crushed. Okay. Paul Overstreet, take another run and take some action. Seeing my father in me and see, that's again Paul Overstreet and all the fun. And give a little bit more of an audio boost here since everybody's since Glass Monster is complaining about the volumes low. Well, yeah, because otherwise you get to hear all the water running and everything else that people are doing upstairs. Okay, Ricky Van Shelton, Love is Burning, and Life's Little Ups and Downs. Some of these in this box, these boxes are in really good condition, actually. Richest Man on Earth, this is Paul Overstreet, and Neath the Light of Your Love. Ricky Van Shelton, Wear My Ring Around Your Neck. Was that the song that Elvis popularized? I think it was. I think that was I think that was the song that Elvis popularized, wasn't it? And who'll turn out the lights? Let's see. The sand and the foam, Don Fogelberg. And full moon. Oh, no, this is uh, Full Moon's the record label or something. What's the song title? Run for the Roses. Okay, that one I don't know. That's okay, though. Stacy Earl, Show Nuff a Star. And Romeo and Juliet fe featuring the Wild Pair. Sounds like it might be like a hip hop -y kind of record by the way they spelled the title. Uh, let's see, Aretha Franklin, If Ever a Love There Was, backed with It Wasn't, It Wasn't, It Ain't Never Gonna Be. And that's Aretha Franklin and Whitney Houston. That was probably one of those special collabs they were doing in the 80s, I suppose. All right, Stan Garland moving on, and just an old love song. Aretha Franklin again, Sweet Bitter Love. And who's zooming now? Who's zooming who? Is that what that says? I think that's what it says. It's a little cut off, but I don't know. Again, some of these songs I don't know. Sweet Country Music by Atlanta. And Seven Bridges Road. Leroy Parnell, The Rock, and Tender Moment. Waylon Jennings and Willie Nelson. So Waylon and Willie put me on a train back to Texas. And if I can find a clean shirt. Let's see. Nat Stuckey. That's all she ever said except goodbye, I think that is. It's cut off a little bit. And after the lovin' has passed. Okay. Mel McDaniel with the Oklahoma wind. Where'd that woman go? And you've got another thing coming if you think I'm coming back to take another drink of your wine. That is the longest song title I have ever seen. That's one song, is it not? Yes. Okay. Long, long song title. TM Dawn looking through patient eyes. And somebody crumpled our sleeve here. The other side is... The Ways of the Wind radio edit. So 
Is it edited for time or edited for swear words? Which is it? Oh, here we go. Sawmill by Mel Tillis. I actually know this song. The Boxmasters did a version of this at a later time, and I liked it a lot. The original wasn't as much of a fan, but Mama's going to pray. That's actually kind of cool to find that record, just because I know what it is. Look up, just for fun, if you want to, look up the Boxmasters version of Sawmill. That's actually really well done. Let's see. George Harrison, all those years ago, and Teardrops. So that's uh, that's cool. Another Mel Tillis, One Night Fever. And Time Has Treated You Well. Jeannie Seeley, I do as I do as much for you, and I miss you. Chicago, another rainy day in New York City, and hope for love. Hillary Cantor, hey, and my heart's saying yes. And I think this is the same record. Yes, I have two copies of that same record. And actually, I have two copies of that Chicago record also. Okay. Oh, here's an old country song. Actually, not really that old of a country song. Sammy Kershaw, the queen of my double wide trailer. What year did this come out? Was this even, was this still 80s or was this 90s? 93. 93. Ninety-three. See, they lied. They said that these were '80s records, and I'm—I already found like '90s records. I found friggin' Pearl Jam in this thing. A memory that just won't quit is the B side of that. For some reason, I almost want to throw that off the stack, and because I—that's re- a song I remember. Once in a while, there's a country song that actually isn't "Achy Breaky Heart" that I find amusing. Um, Victoria Shaw, Cry Wolf, and Love's Not Gonna Pass Me By. Okay. Hot Time in the Old Town Tonight, Guy Lombardo. There's like an old standards thing, and Auld Lang Syne. Guy Lomb- uh, see, this is the kind of Lawrence Welke kind of records I was expecting to find. Um, you know, no no offense to Enkelbert Humperdinck fans, but, you know. Sweet and Possible You, Brenda Lee. And the grass is greener. That's interesting. Those are vintage country. And Leapy Lee, I'm going to send my love. And here comes the rain. I'm trying to remember. Leapy Lee, that artist had another, I think, a novelty kind of record that went over real well. And a few of these are going to go to the record cleaning machine so we can play them. And a few, and some of these other ones will play with time, but let's see. Nelson, Will You Love Me? And Can't Live Without Your Love and Affection. So that's Nelson as in like Rick Nelson's kids. Halen, Judgment Day, backed with Dreams. See, what's the name? The last name is Kemp. What's the first name? Tara Kemp. Hold you tight on both sides. Painted Lady by Chuck Woolery. Like the game show host, Chuck Woolery. He's a that's the game show guy, isn't it? That's the dating game guy. And he has a record of Painted Lady. Okay, that's weird. Okay. Let's see. Dolly Parton, just as good as gone in Wash Day Blues. Wash Day Blues sounds like a country song if there ever was one, ain't it? Yeehaw. Kathy Matea, What Could Have Been. That's 91, yeah. And Time Passes By. Sammy Kershaw, can't reach her anymore. What might have been? 
more Sammy Kershaw yard sale. What am I worth? Sweet dreams by air supply. Don't turn me away by air supply. We've already gotten through a bunch of air supply records. Wait, did I go through this? No, I did go. No, this is this is the last stack. I did not go through this. What am I thinking about? My brain is, I'm seeing duplicates of a few other ones. Okay, adios and a little brown jug, Glenn Miller. So that's a Glenn Miller repop record. Again, got to keep the, got to keep grandma happy at the pub too. Eric Carmen, my girl, and Sunrise. Let's see, Willie Nelson without a song, and can't begin to tell you. Lucky Star by Madonna. And I know it's on the B side. That would be a record. This would be a radio promotional record. Wish You Were Here, Barbara Mandrell. With the B side of She's Out Dancing the Night Alone. Okay. Marty Stewart, Maria. I love to see you again. I think that one, I think I remember that song. And all because of you. Heart, what he don't know. And if looks could kill. Faith Hill. Yeah, some of these are later. Go the distance. And wild one. Yeah, some of these are definitely later. Barbara Streisand, here we are at last. And we're not making love anymore. That's well, because you look like Barbara Streisand. Okay, all right. What else do we have? Uh, the Alan Parsons Project, Days Are Numbers, and Somebody Out There. Leroy Parnell, Done Deal, Love Without Mercy. Johnny Lee, The Yellow Rose, and Say When. Another Johnny Lee, Rock and Roll Money. And they've never had to get over you. George Strait, Rhythm of the Road. And it ain't cool to be crazy about you. Take you tonight. Let's see, Ozark Mountain Daredevils. And Running Out. That one I don't know. Pablo Cruz, Jenny, and Cool Love. David Pack, Prove Me Wrong. On both sides, probably a radio record. McBride and the Ride, Don't Be Mean to Me, and No More Crying. Jennifer McCarter and the McCarters. That's a lot of McCarters. Moving on. Better be home soon. More McBride in the ride. Same old star. And Stone Country. Tommy Page, I'm falling in love. And I'll be your everything. Love Helps Those, Paul Overstreet. I think I remember this one. Is that the country song? Love helps those who cannot help themselves. I think so. I think that's the one. And So in Love. I think that one I actually know. Oh, here's something that's not country. Sticks. Light Up. And Born for Adventure. PM Dawn, The Ways of the Wind. And Looking Through Patient Eyes. Radio Edit. New Kids on the Block, <laughs> If You Go Away, and Games, The Kids Get Hard Mix. <laughs> okay, that's not supposed to sound offensive, but I hate to tell you, it does. Okay, we're going to put that aside to troll the wife with.
Don't Let Go, Mel Tillis and Sherry Rice. And Why Not Do the Thing? I know Mel Tillis anyway. Fly Away Again by Dave Dudley. And There You Are Again by Dave Dudley. That one's not registering with me. Sweet Summer Days of My Life, Tony Orlando and Dawn. And it only hurts when I try to smile. Roger Daltrey, Hearts Right, Heart Dash S Right, how do you pronounce that? And Come and Get Your Love. Come Home to Me by George Jones. And She Loved a Lot in Her Time. That would be No Show Jones. His alcoholism prevented him from making a lot of concert dates, and he got a bad nickname on account of it. And he embraced it and printed it on a t shirt. All right. Forgive and Forget, Kieran Kane with I'm Here to Love You. Uh, there's a Neil, Neil Diamond. And the Grass Won't Pay No Mind. And Suliyama, an African trilogy, too. Okay. More Neil Diamond, Crunchy Granola Sweet. And Stones. That's not the kind of Neil Diamond songs I know. Even the Nights Are Better, Air Supply, and One Step Closer. He's a Cowboy from Texas by Ronnie McDowell. And When It Comes to You. Personality by Ronnie McDowell. And you make my day pay off all night long. When I see personality, I wonder if that's the... That almost sounds like the old... Was it 50 song? I'm trying to even remember who did Was it Ray Price that did the old version of it? Older Woman, Ronnie McDowell. And this is a demonstration, so this was a radio record. I think I know which... I think I know what that is. If I remember right, I think I know that song. Mel McDaniel, All the Sweet on Both Sides, another promo record. This one's tricky to read. Ten Years, Three Kids, and Two Loves Too Late, Mel McDaniel. That sounds like a country song if there was one. And Take Me to the Country. Yeah, yeah that's country record, all right. It's got to have mamas, trucks, trains, and getting drunk in it. All right, Ronnie McDowell, Strings of Silver Satin, and All Tied Up. And another copy of the same record. All right. Another Mc Mel McDaniel shoestring and worn out shoe. So this is a very shoe-oriented record. Actually, the funny thing is, is some of these promo records that they used to do, like where this would be the A side, and then when you flip it over, it's like the same song backwards. It might be one of those. Um, Lover's Minuet, Floyd Kramer. I think I've already seen this. And Dallas. I already saw that one somewhere else, and this has a jukebox tag in it. Yeah. Jukebox tag done on a typewriter. Old Helen, I think it is, by Red Steagle. And if you've got the time. That's, I don't know. I don't know that one. Maybe that's a, is that a cover maybe of the one that was made famous by Hank Williams? The Greenest Grass in the Town by Earl Conley. And when I'm under the table, I'll be over you. That's a nice, that's a country beer drinking song if there ever was one. One of our uh, customers and friends of ours is a big country fan. He might get a chuckle out of some of these. Uh, Earl Thomas Conley, Fire and Smoke, backed with Somewhere Between Right and Wrong. 
Let's see. Honor Bound remix version. Earl Thomas Conley. And Too Hot to Handle. More Earl Thomas Conley. After Love Slips Away. Backed with Smoky Mountain Memories. If these ain't country songs, I don't know what they is. Swingin' Home for Christmas by the Tractors, and the B-side is the Santa Claus Boogie. Oh my gosh, what year was this? This was the 90s. It had to be 92 and 94. Yeah, this was that Boogie Woogie Choo Choo Train song, and then they just slapped Santa Claus in the middle of it and shipped it out again. And this is a repop. George Strait's version of White Christmas and When It's Christmas Time in Texas. So there's your Christmas songs for y'all. Honky Tonk Hearts by John Anderson. And the B-side is Wild and Blue. The Way I Feel About You. Who is this? Karen White. And that's a AB side, same same song, radio record probably. It's a small small world by the Mike Cub Congregation, or Mike Curb Congregation. Okay, shining on me. That sounds like it might be a when I see congregation and it's a song like shining on me. It sounds like it's a gospel record, but it's probably not. And I just don't know what I'm looking at. Linda Ronstadt, Walk On, and The Waiting. Little Texas, The Only Thing I'm Sure Of, and My Love. Another Little Texas, this is uh, First Time for Everything, and Some Guys Have All the Love. And more, Little Texas, Cry On, I'd Rather Miss You. I say jukebox records and country bars have to have country music, right, y'all? Amy's Back in Austin. And excerpts from Country World Premiere Radio Show. Interesting, was this a radio record instead of a jukebox record? Hmm. Well, there's still more. I guess we can do the last stack here. And... Let's get through this. Kathy Dalton, pour your wine all over me, backed with boogie bands and one night stands. I don't know if that's a country record or not, but it could be. Uh, David Allen Coe, The Bright Morning Light and Suicide. David Allen Coe, boy, he did some really, really famous country songs like You Never Call Me By My Name, which was argued as the perfect country western song. And then he wrote a bunch of other songs that probably would get you banned in today's society, if not from whatever. But, you know, he did what he wanted to do. Probably did a couple spots in prison. Carnival by Sergio Mendez. And never gonna let you go. Let's see. Point blank. Restless. And Nicole. My point blank. As we lay, Shirley Murdoch. Again, both an A and a B side, so that's probably a radio record. Eric, and Don't Bring Me Down, Eric Burden and the Animals, and Sky Pilot. Paul Anka, Good Night, My Love, Pleasant Dreams. This was probably to keep Grandma and Grandpa happy. Eso Beso, That Kiss. That's probably in Spanish, I believe. Bezo, I think, is a kiss, right? That's Spanish, I think, right? Patty LaBelle, I can fly, and I can't complain. 
someone's walking around upstairs, George Strait, and I am, am I blue? BJ Thomas, new looks from old lover, new looks from an old lover, and you keep the man in me happy and the child in me alive. That's a very long title. Conway Twitty. It's only make-believe. Now, that's a country beer-drinking song if there ever was. And the B-side is The Rose. Mickey Gilly and the Playboy Records. You always, if it had a Playboy bunny on it, you knew it was Mickey Gilly's record. She Called Me Baby and Room Full of Roses. Oh, yes, that's an old country beer-drinking song if there ever was one. Frank Sinatra, New York, New York. And You and Me. Okay. Well, that was probably for Grandma and Grandpa to be happy at the pub in their jukebox with the jukebox there. The Things We Do for Love, 10cc. And Taking Care of Business by Bachman Turner Overdrive. So this one is one of those double A side. That's a jukebox record. And my phone just went off. And it's a friend of ours who wants to pick up his completed projects. I have a couple of other completed repairs here that never made it on film. Um, we had some like PA speakers with blown tweeters, so it was a matter of, you know, figuring out the crossover wiring and that kind of stuff. And I didn't think it was that detailed enough to post a video, so sorry. If y'all want more repair videos, just tell me. Um, Danny Stewart's Hawaiians, Alfred Apka. Beyond the Reef. I actually know that song because there was one guy who used to play it on ukulele. And yeah, so this is the Hukalau song. So this is like island music. I know what that is. Okay, Sky Pilot Part 2, Eric Burden and the Animals, and Sky Pilot Part 1. So that's the Collectibles series are kind of a jukebox record, double A side kind of thing that they sold as repops later in time. Red Hot Leroy Parnell, backed with Family Tree Leroy Parnell. Okay. Ricky Van Shelton, Baby I'm Ready, and Don't We All Have the Right? I think I've already seen that one earlier in the stack. Ricky Van Shelton, Call Me Up. And... Back Roads, Ricky Van Shelton, Weekend World, keeping it between the li keep it between the lines. I remember that song. My dad used to scoff at it. What is this about a coloring book? This is dumb. Anyway, that was my dad. Tommy Page, When I Dream of You, backed with You're the Best Thing That Ever Happened to Me. See, Buck Owens and Ringo Starr act naturally. Okay, that'll be fun to listen to because I always liked Buck Owens. Act naturally was cool. And then the keys in the mailbox. I liked Buck Owens. Actually, the instrumental Buckaroo, if you've never heard that before, go listen to it. It's really cool. You don't have to even like country music. You can just appreciate it for guitar. All right, let's see what we've got. Def Leppard, Tear It Down, backed with Woman, the LP version. Def Leppard, the answer to the joke, what has nine arms and sucks? Just kidding. I don't have a problem with Def Leppard. It's a joke. Jokes are funny, even though they're rude. It's okay. All right, let's see. Who is this? This is Louise Mandrell, Goodbye Heartache. And you're a hard act to follow. That's obviously been in a jukebox probably with a felt platter on it. Let's see. The Sadness of It All, Conway Twinney and Loretta Lynn. And you know just what I do. So that's old school beer drinking country. Red Steagle, Jackson Hole, Wyoming. And Three Chord Country Song. Sounds about right. Most country songs are three or four chords, aren't they? Bet Midler, what's this doing in there? I remember, I remember you slash Dixie's dream, 
and every road leads back to you. Okay. Men at work, crazy. And down under. There you go. There's a meme record for you. Put that in the meme record pile. All right. Saving all my love to you by Pake McIntyre. And I'm having fun. If I'm pronouncing any of these wrong, it's okay. BJ Thomas, we're here to love. And the whole world's in love when you're lonely. That's Cleveland International. That's interesting that that record label would exist. I didn't know about it. Let's see. I've got my faults by Waylon Jennings. And just talking. Matthews, Wright, and King, Mother's Eyes, and When the River Runs High, The Mavericks, All That Heaven Will Allow, and Pretend, Criss Cross, They'll Make You Jump Jump, uh, Warm It Up, what does that say? Dupritz, Dupritz mix or something. What does that say? Dupree's mix. I'm trying to read it upside down and warm it up the LP version. So apparently Criss Cross really wanted to try to get something beyond that jump jump song. Eh, whatever. All right. And Little Texas, what were you thinking? And just one more night. I think we've seen that one a few times before. Neil Diamond, Heartlight, and You Don't Know Me. I think we've seen that one before. And Full Circle, Johnny Rodriguez with Maxine. Why Not Do the Thing, Mel Tillis. And don't let it go. I think I have seen a few of these. I feel like I'm on repeat. We Never Made It to Chicago by Billy Crash Craddock. And Robin Hood is the B-side of that. So I think that actually gets through our stacks of records that we have here. Um, that's quite a few. I think we've gone over. Uh, they, they said approximately 600. I don't know. I wasn't counting. But uh, there's a lot of records here that are at least significant. They're not my style. They're somebody's style. Um, I don't see a bunch of, you know, trash records here. And uh, there's plenty of trolley records in here. And there's a few of them that I'm actually really happy to have. So uh, cool stuff. Thanks for watching and have a great night.